cameras in the car, so we gotta do this on the phone. But waking up with the sun today. In the new house, you can hear the hustle and bustle of the streets. It's December 3rd, but it's never too late to attempt to vlog this. Vlog this. Vlog this. <laughs> so here we go. Hi, here we are again in my car, always in my car. This is the spot. I feel like I should start decorating it as if you're like coming to my house or something. Anyway, I like to start my morning drives with, and this is like a problem and this is probably not good. So don't try this at home. If you do, it's on you. I buy the Bath and Body Works room sprays and I like to spray them in my car. I move from one obsession to the other. And one of my current obsessions is smells, scents. So I went and I looked for the fragrance that they had the least of because obviously that means that it's good. And I got peppermint sugar cookie and I'm not usually like a cookie kind of girl, but put a couple sprays of that in the car. Oh my God, it smells so good in here. Oh my gosh, it smells like Christmas. And then on top of that, talk about like scent things. I also subscribe to Scentbird because I, I love perfume, but I hate when you get used to the smell of your perfume and then you don't smell yourself anymore. So you overspray and next thing you know, it just, you're not smelling that delicious smell anymore. This is not sponsored, obviously. <laughs> Toka Colette and Toka, Toka, Taka, Toka. I mean, dude, talk about butchering. It's a, it's it just smells really nice. And this one is supposed to be a French girl. Mm. Make me smell like your French girl. So I'm on my way to work. I work this weekend and then no work scheduled currently for quite a while. <laughs> yeah. Let's go to work. You're obviously not gonna see that part of my life, but I wanna start this off with something that every cliche bitch does, and that is get a Starbucks coffee from somewhere because we have to be that basic holiday bitch. So let's go get Starbucks. Yes! Please don't be a line. Please don't be a line. Okay, so the question is, what do we want to get? Also, you should only get a tall because then you can actually enjoy it and potentially finish it. I think we're gonna do that. Ow, I just, oh, pinched, pinched something, but I felt a pop. I can't move. Ah. Thank you, Richard, and Starbucks. What can I get started for you? Hi, good morning. Um, can I please get a tall Irish cream cold brew? Okay. And that'll be all. Four fifty-five. Thank you. Do you like the view? Hi. Hi. Good, thank you. The person in front of you actually covered your order today. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I'll cover the person behind me. That's so nice. I love when people do that. <laughs> Thank you. Have a nice morning. Oh my gosh, this is about to taste like even better than I thought it was going to taste because the person in front of me just bought my drink. Oh my god, what a sweetie. People never do nice things like that anymore. Oh, that was so nice. And then of course, like, you have to buy the drink for the person behind you. I mean, unless you're like hard up on cash. It's the right thing to do. Oh, that was so nice. So here is my free, well, almost free, Irish cream cold brew. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
this a little bit of like cinnamon and the sweetness. I mean, I can't pretend like I'm some crazy like taste tester person, but it is everything. And if you get a tall, it's not as, you know, full of bad stuff for you as if you were to get something even bigger, if that's something that you care about. It's something I care about. It makes me feel a little bit better inside. Mmm, mmm. It just, it's sweet. It tastes like holidays. It makes me happy. Mmm. I do get sad though when the cream is out. Like, okay, do other people just like stir the cream all around? Like, look at the consistency of that. Mm. That tastes like Christmas. Oh my God. I'm sure by now everyone has tried it, but if you have not, get your little buns down to Starbucks and get yourself an Irish cream cold brew. And you know what? Maybe you should also buy the drink for the person behind you. Like how nice. But you know what? Maybe it wasn't even that guy's idea. Maybe someone bought the drink for him. Like I wonder what the longest train is of something like that. I would be interested to ask someone at Starbucks like, when, what is the longest amount of time that people have bought drinks for the other people behind them? Mm. It's gonna be a great, fantastic day. So with that, I bid thee adieu, and I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>